problem? Hi. What's your name? What's your name, delicate? This is Chloe. Come here, boss. And this is Pumpkin. This is Pumpkin. So Pumpkin. No, that's Chloe. Pumpkin's to the left of you. Oh, that's Pumpkin. Uh -huh. okay. So Pumpkin is a little more. Oh, careful there. See, she's got a little more brindling. Her face is, she has a beautiful black mask, but a little more brindling right here. So, yes, you're okay. All right, here we go. So, she's kind of, she's kind of a spitfire. She's like, I don't know if I want you to hold me or not. No, we need some love. Look at your little star on your chest. You need some love. Hmm. Yeah. What do you think about that? So one thing to pass your good canine citizenship, you actually, the they pick up your dog's feet. I missed last Saturday, and if I have a litter this Saturday, I'm going to miss this Saturday's training. So this is something that I do recommend you do, especially if you never touch their feet until you get ready to dremel them. They're like, hey, don't touch my feet. So, and this is just something that we do with them, touching their feet. Their feet are very sensitive. Hi, sweet baby, you give me some kisses. That's just being, she just being submissive. Hmm. Let's see your bite. Ooh, perfectly level at this time. Perfectly level at this time. Mm -hmm. So, in their defense, they don't know that you're not going to drop them. Gravity's pulling on them in a different dimension, kind of a different way when they're in the air, right? So she's relaxed right now. Let's see what she does. We'll turn her over. She'll probably have a fit. There we go. So I'm not going to drop you. I'm not going to drop you. There we go. Whoops. There's somebody in there. Somebody at my feet. Alright, here we go. So she's definitely hanging on to me. <laughs> hanging on, Mom. Hanging on for dear life. I'm not going to drop you. So don't ever pretend like you're going to drop them either. That's just being mean. But if I carried her around all day, she'd settle down a little bit more. I do like this brindling on her ears. Can you see this brindling on her back? Mm -hmm. All right, pumpkin pie. See this? She's a little lighter back here. And even this is more of a red fawn brindling. This is... A little bit more of a fawn brindling back here. Oh, you got a bulldog tail, do you? I don't know if that tail will touch your hawk or not. Let's see. I got goodies on. I got goodies right here. First puppy's going to be medium size. There we go. We're on the table. She's still clenching. She's still clenching onto me. Okay. Right here. A piece of cheese. Oh, we love cheese. You got cheese on your nose, baby. Okay. You can stand up on your own. There you go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Look, all of them have decent depth of chest and amount of bone. your top line a little bit. You'll do. Well, she's all got it now. I'm trying to keep her from biting me with those sharp teeth. She goes, let it go. Let it go. Let it go. So, if I was training, you know, I would close my hand for, to her being a little aggressive with the food and only open it when she settled down. She don't really want them to be aggressive with food. And they all are with each other. It's not mean that they're going to be aggressive dogs. It means that 
right now they all eat together and they push against each other and they do a lot of that. Oops, careful baby. Stuff nice like that. You just swallowed. You didn't even chew and savor the flavor. You didn't even chew and savor the flavor. So these guys will be seven weeks old. It doesn't seem possible, does it? Um, Thursday Tomorrow. or Friday? Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Yep. So we're going to be sending out these videos and actually uploading them. So we're going to go to the YouTube channel and watch them. We're going to be picking our puppies and final payments were due last week. <laughs> but in your defense, I have not done individual videos of them yet. So someone's snoring over there. Who's snoring over there? So this is Pumpkin. Bestie. Bestie. Mm -hmm. She has a snore. 